Well, here's an office that a lot of people forget about <laughs> when they're looking for government programs you know, uh, to get help. And, and that's your career one stop. And this is part of the workforce development uh, office that we have in every county. You know, and there's a lot of money programs. We got a lot of money and and it's there so people could get jobs full time, part time or whatever. Or if, if you get trained for a better job or, or learn about money programs while you're looking for a job. So, yeah, and this is why it, it, we go to the social services agency and things like that. But this is, man, we're here to also create income. And so this is important office to uh, touch base with, uh, because if you find your local office, uh, and if you, you could Google career one stop dot org <laughs> and put find a, a local office, but it's in your county government and you can find out about extended unemployment benefits. See, there's about four different kinds of unemployment benefits now. So to make sure that you're getting all of them, uh, <laughs> whether extended or maybe if you lost your job because of imports, there's extra money for that or money to live on while you're looking for a job. See, that's another thing that they have or money to live on while you're training for a better job. Yep. And things like that or to get money to train for a job. Now that's cool too, because for a few months, maybe you could take, and they'll pay for it. They have grant money to pay for you to take courses and, and get certificates so you could get a better paying job. Uh, or even some uh, offices have programs like to fix your car so you can get to work. Man, <laughs> now that's important too. So all these things that come up are barriers for you to get income. Uh, and that's why it's, a, it's an office to check. You know, so the other offices I talk about, you know, are there just to give money. These are to give money, but all around getting a job. And that's what you need in the long run is continual income, not a one-time grant. And also uh, there's things like you could get, uh, if you're looking for a job but don't have skills, the government will pay your employer money to train you. <laughs> so it costs them nothing for you to get that job and the government pays for that. So they have all kinds of special help just for young people, special help for seniors uh, and everything. And it's really around uh, earning income. And, th and that's what we're really about in the long term, you know, the, the, the fast grants to solve your rent problems and things like that. But then we have long term things that we have to create income for ourselves. Uh, so whether you're 16 or 106, <laughs> this is what this office is, and try to call. Try to call. Uh, you may because of the pandemic, there's not a lot of around, but hang on the phone or whatever. Try to do this personally. The more you could do personally, the more you'll get benefits back because <laughs> it's human nature. <laughs> you see somebody struggling, you want to help them. But if they're a digit on the computer, ah, I'll go to the next digit. <laughs> so use your personality uh, and whatever you got to get the most out of these sources. They're there <laughs> whether you use them or not. <laughs> so use them. You know the fat cats are. So you could be a millionaire and still get you know $10,000 to train for a new job. Millionaires, right? <laughs> so if you're struggling, man, you should get this too.